Hey guys, this is Eric from the Eclipse, one of the new owner, one of the new owner operators here. I wanted to go over some simple things about fishing aboard a big boat. One of the most important things we talked about is bait selection, and then the next thing would be is about how to how to actually fish on the boat on the appropriate side, and how to not interfere with the whole process of everyone's lines getting tangled and all that. So the first thing is we talked about, you're gonna, you're gonna grab your bait, you're gonna pin it on. If the boat is drifting this way, you're gonna be starting on the opposite side. You can only fish on one side of these boats while they're drifting. If it's anchored, that's a second thing. But while they're drifting, if it's drifting this way, you can only fish on this side of the boat. If it's fishing this way, you can only fish on this side of the boat. And we're gonna talk about if we're drifting this way. You would pin on your bait, you would go to this corner right here. There should be nobody here because they should all be fishing from here to there because the boat is drifting this way. You would grab your bait, put your reel in free spool, either cast it out a little bit if you can or drop it in and the, and the current would take it. Now, as the boat's drifting this way, Everyone is, everyone is going to be moving. So you'll be starting here and walking up the rail. The boat's drifting this way. Everyone comes behind you. You always want to keep your lines tight. No angles, no tangles, the old saying. And one of the most important things I see people mess up on is they just sit there and talk to their buddy and they're just letting it out. You actually have to feel the bait. You have to let it take line off the spool. You have to feel the wiggle or your line's not going to be straight. So as you're walking, the boat's still moving this way, drifting. You're slowly doing what's called the tuna shuffle. You're walking up the rail, letting line out, feeling that bait swim. The guys are all coming in behind you. New guys are putting baits in and walking up the rail. And typically, if you haven't got a, a, a bite, by the time you're up to the bow, it's a perfect time to wind in and grab a, grab a new bait and start the whole process over again. We would love for you to come aboard the Eclipse with me and Captain Jeff Walker and we can show you these tips and teach you some secret tips. You can find us at fishyclips.com, on Facebook at Fish Eclipse and Instagram Fish Eclipse. The season's starting to slow down but we have tr plenty of trips running out of Seaforth with a lot of room. Please come out and fish with us. Thanks, guys.